right, let's hear that new song. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four, and a... I went to a party, it was the fourth one this week. I dumped my boyfriend Marty, because he was a geek. Grendel, that was so extremely, extraordinarily bad. What? That took me 15 minutes to write. Are you serious? You know, I think it was just lacking anything not bad. What are you trying to say? Well, you have absolutely no talent, and you're uglier than my mother-in-law. <laughs> Well, what I'm trying to say is... You can't fire me! I quit! Ah, my foot! Wait, no! I don't really care. Ask me, I'm the best creature under the sun. Yeah, it was just another long day at work. Can't work with musicians anymore. He quit on me. Oh, hello? Hello? Figures, they canceled my phone. What is that music? Can I help you? Um. Uh... You can't fire me! I quit! Ah, my foot! Actually, you can! My Hello. name is Hrothgar McMead Hall, the 27th, and I'm a music producer. My name is Beowulf Fluoweb, and I am a music extraordinaire. I recently lost a musical talent, and I'm looking for someone to fill the void. Now what makes you think you're worthy of my musical prowess? Excuse me, you don't know who I am? I'll have you know that I'm above performing in the commercial music industry. I couldn't tell by your dumpy house. Well. Well, I guess you're just not up for the challenge. A challenge, you say? Well, then I accept. Well, come with me to my studio and we'll see what you've got. said that was much better than Grendel's screeching. Who? Grendel was my previous client. He was a pop star but his music was trash. He must have not been very successful. But that's the thing, he has so many fans. Wait, but if his music is bad, then why do they like him? Because he's easy to like. He has tons of songs and they all sound the same. I guess people like easy listening. 
Well, my music is so deep and meaningful. That's what we have to show people. They have to learn what music used to be like. But how can we show them? We'll figure that out tomorrow. Today, I have a quinceañera to attend, so I'm closing off the studio. All right, bye. Baby, we've been waiting here for three hours. Where are they? Shit, they come. Now, now. Ah, didn't expect to meet you here, huh? Yeah. Are you the legendary nincompoop known as Beowulf? Yes, I am. I mean, no, no. Who are you again? Baby, who am I? I'm legendary musical entrepreneur, Melvin Unferth. And I am Beowulf Fluoeb, musical genius. Baby, I've heard of you. You have? Yeah, I've heard of you. You're that dirty hipster who lives in the swamp and exceeds trashy tunes. You pretentious fop, how dare you? Your music is a huge waste of time, baby. I mean, it's been said that it takes years just to compose one song. And you never even won any kind of music awards either, baby. That may be so, but at least my hair does not resemble an electrocuted rat. What did you just say, baby? You see, everything I write is more than just a compilation of sounds. It's a menagerie of thoughts and ideas. I mean, no disrespect, baby. But your opinions are reminiscent of fecal matter. You are a swarthy brine skimmer. You are a voracious trickleberry, baby. Wow, what a surprise. Have you been hiding over there this whole time? No. Meet my new protege, Grendel, baby. So this is the uncultured pop musician. <laughs> that foot if you can. So you really want to try to work that range of motion, rounding those shoulders forward in your leg. Huh. You are nice. I didn't have to go to a kitchen yet. Down towards that foot. And begin. Always keep it nice. What the blazes is that noise? What are you rapscallions doing here? These incompetent haberdashers are trying to destroy my pride. Did it walk, baby? No. You traitor! You left me for him? We were gonna be famous together! Actually, you left me. And your music sucks. Everybody, shut up! If you want to prove you're better than us, we'll see you at this. See ya there, bang weenie! The Herit 300th Annual Battle of the Bands. An evening of powdered wigs and power cords. Friday, October 31st at the Mead Hall Center. Against 299 time champion Grendel Smith. You know, you don't have to do this. No. I must defeat the monster that thinks that his terrible tunes will defeat my harmonious masterpieces. Well, we better start training right now. But what about your quinceanera? Oh, I just remembered, I left a casserole in the microwave. Considering you've won all 299 battles of the band so far. Wait, wait, what about the rumors? You have the competition rigged. Right, baby, come on, we gotta get out of here. Ready for this? Take my glasses. I don't need them. I hope you brought a defibrillator!
Ladies and gentlemen, our judge for tonight, from the depths of the Amazon jungle, Simone Cowell! Our first contestant for tonight, national pop star and cheap icon, Grendel Smith. Now this is a little song I wrote in the bathroom last night. I went to a party, it was the fourth one this week. I dumped my boyfriend Marty, because he was a geek. takes to write a song, the more of a weenie their composer is. <laughs> Your song is gonna be better than mine! For our final contestant, please welcome an undiscovered hobo musician, Beowulf Fluoweb! Beowulf Fluoweb? That's just Beowulf backwards. Wait, his name is Beowulf Beowulf. I heard it took him three years to write this song. <laughs> Thank you, thank you all. Although I most certainly deserve this award in every respect and angle you can think of, I will not accept it, for I do not need to possess the physical manifestation of my success. No, my friends, the mere knowledge of it is enough to sustain me 
and keep my chin high for many a year to come. It is for this reason that I bestow the trophy upon Grendel. The creature who holds quantity and effete flashiness above quality and real substance. This is a twisted and exiguous outlook on life that should not be held by anyone. It mutates and distorts your body and very soul into a despicable, hopeless, conniving husk in a constant race with its own compulsion and greed. And this is why I give the award to him. Autographs will be signed in the lobby. <laughs> Now listen here, Grendel. Shut up! I hate you! I'd like you to have the trophy. You really mean it? Yes, I do, Grendel. But I'd like you to understand something. What? Instant gratification is just a placebo for the soul. It has no real reward. Thanks for the advice. Maybe I'll- What are you doing with this pile of scum? I ordered you to get in the car right now, or I'll- You killed my mother! Second verse.